Shout out my nigga Mikey T, the movie star. Me and OBH hit house studios right now. Get that. You're now flying with first class films. I wasn't really supposed to be the street guy. I was at fuck. I played for my middle school, high school ball team. With the job court, I played for the ball team, won championships. This day I was from the hood, so once I got back there, got a job and everything. I made a decision though. I came back when I was 18, I was away. Going to school away. Came back when I was 17, I came back. And I'm sitting back, I got a little job. And my cousin and my right hand man, they didn't want to really turn me out. I'm sitting there watching them niggas make big bank rolls. I'm gonna all back and be the motherfucker all day watching me thousands. Then you go to work. And my mom making like $170 a week. I'm like, I'm here all day with y'all. It's just it's easy for me to make thousands. I'm, I'm with y'all. Why y'all making y'all thousands? I'm right here. These are my best friends, my cousin. I'm watching y'all make thousands. I could have said, give me that. I made a thousand. You know what I said? I said, no. That's, why, that's a intestinal fortitude I got. Never went with the trend. I always did my own thing. I was, I had a job. I'm a shot niggas and everything. I'm still I'm going to work. Motherfuckers start just trying to like, you know, niggas got envious basically. Because I got locked up. My man said, I don't have nobody. And he said, I said, I'm here now. Fuck work. Quit my job. I'm right to block. Now, and now we make it off the most. When we open our block up, nobody needs money. So it's like, who the fuck is this little nigga? Little ad? No. They got shut. We need parts of that. They look at me like a little ad. Little ad. We need parts of that. No, they're not get no parts of that. Shit got real. My man popped and his brother got killed. He quit. He said, man, I ain't fuck this block. I mean, I got enough money. Too much, too much going on. I said, leave it to me. Yeah. Left me the block. Block was doing 10,000 every day. That's what I did. So imagine a nigga 17, 18, block doing 10,000. Everybody from every part of the area come to that block trying to take it. He never took it. So imagine what I was doing. Imagine the reason why he never took it. Imagine. You know why he never took it? I was firing their ass up every time they came. One thing I know, everybody can shoot. Nobody likes getting shot. So when they shoot, you stand there and look at them. And you give it back. You can see that fucking fear in the eyes. It gets out of here. Then you go to their block. Go to their block again tomorrow. In the morning. Then the afternoon. Then at night time. Then you get phone calls. Hey, I quit. I don't know no more. That nigga's in two. Or don't ever come around here again. And everybody can vouch for that. Everybody out there, they gonna vouch for that. Go take a trip down my neighborhood by yourself and ask niggas, who's ad? What ad? What's ad doing? I'm gonna tell you. I ran my neighborhood. It's not no fucking fit. That's the difference between me and these other rap niggas. I own, I ran my shit. I wasn't, like, I'm not from the hood. I am my hood. I ran my hood. So, niggas can't say Ab can't go back to his hood. This is my fucking neighborhood. Even if I make a, I'm a, I'm a million, you know, even if I ever make a millionaire rapper, I know I can go back. They still scared of me. It's not how I go back and check in with somebody. No, y'all gotta check in with me. I'm the dude that you got to check in with. You know what I'm saying? It's different. You're like, I can go, niggas, even the even niggas can't go back to the old. I can go back to the old. I'm, I'm, me and my dude are cool with them niggas. No, I was the dude that everybody's scared of. So it's like, the monster's back. Y'all just giving them, all they're they going to do is make a monster rich. Now I can make all my monsters rich. I can turn my savages to make them rich. The nigga came through, shit went smooth I left the nigga head laying in the pool My dog started asking for a breakdown Then I spun around and smacked the nigga with the
the two. He screamed, damn, Ab, this me, Jason. You gon' kill me for some fucking paper? You left me dead rotting in that fucking cell. 